blocked every blocked shot by Dikembe Mutombo. Mutombo knocks it down his throat. What I'm doing is just a setting an example, not just for the Africa, and also for anybody who playing the sport or go up becoming successful. That they, I feel that they, we do have an obligation to give something back in the place that we came from. Dikembe Mutombo born June 25, 1966 and died on September 30, 2024, was a Congolese-American professional basketball player. He was born in Kinshasa, Democratic Republic of the Congo, as one of ten children to Samuel and Bayamba Marie Mutombo. His father was initially a school principal and later worked in Congo's Department of Education. Mutombo is multilingual, speaking English, French, Spanish, Portuguese, and five Central African languages, including Lingala and Chiluba. He belongs to the Luba ethnic group. Mutombo attended Boboto College in Kinshasa for high school, aiming to prepare for a medical career due to the challenging curriculum. He played football and practiced martial arts. Around age 16, encouraged by his father and brother due to his height, he started focusing on basketball. In 1987, at 21, Mutombo moved to the United States for college, enrolling at Georgetown University on a USAID scholarship. Initially planning to become a doctor, he was recruited by Georgetown Hoyas basketball coach John Thompson to play basketball. Upon his arrival, Mutombo spoke little English and took ESL classes. As a sophomore, he blocked 12 shots in a single game. His shot-blocking prowess, along with teammate Alonzo Mourning, led to the creation of a rejection row section for fans under the basket at games. Mutombo was named the Big East Defensive Player of the Year in 1990 and 1991. His international background and interests were notable during his time at Georgetown, where he interned for the U.S. Congress and the World Bank. He graduated in 1991 with degrees in linguistics and diplomacy. Daikimbi Mutombo played 18 seasons in the NBA and was nicknamed Mount Mutombo for his exceptional defensive skills. He is widely recognized as one of the greatest shot blockers and defensive players in basketball history. Mutombo won the NBA Defensive Player of the Year award four times, sharing the record with Ben Wallace. He led the NBA in blocked shots three times, topped the league in rebounds twice, and was selected for eight All-Star teams. On January 10, 2007, he became second on the NBA's all-time career blocks list. Apart from basketball, Mutombo is renowned for his humanitarian efforts. Standing 7 feet 2 inches tall and weighing 260 pounds, 120 kilograms, Mutombo moved from the Democratic Republic of the Congo to the United States at 21 to play college basketball for the Georgetown Hoyas. In 1991, he was the fourth overall pick in the NBA draft by the Denver Nuggets. Over his NBA career, he played for six teams and appeared in the NBA Finals with the Philadelphia 76ers in 2001 and the New Jersey Nets in 2003. Mutombo retired after the 2009 NBA playoffs. His number 55 jersey has been retired by both the Denver Nuggets and the Atlanta Hawks. He was inducted into the Naismith Memorial Basketball Hall of Fame on September 11, 2015. About Daikimbi Mutombo's personal life. Mutombo met his wife, Rose, during a visit to Kinshasa in 1995. They reside in Atlanta and have three children together, along with four adopted children from Rose's deceased brothers. Mutombo is a naturalized American citizen. He was present at Brussels Airport during the 2016 Brussels bombings on March 22, 2016, and later assured his safety through a Facebook post. On October 15, 2022, Mutombo revealed he was undergoing treatment for a brain tumor. In February 2013, he featured in a Geico auto insurance commercial, humorously showcasing his shot-blocking skills in everyday scenarios. Mutombo received the Sager Strong Award on June 25, 2018. About Daikimbi Mutombo's professional career Daikimbi Mutombo entered the NBA in 1991 as the fourth overall pick by the Denver Nuggets. His immediate impact was evident as he was named to the All-Star team in his rookie year, thanks to his exceptional shot-blocking skills. By the 1993-94 season, Mutombo had become the cornerstone of the Nuggets, leading them to a 42-40 record and a playoff berth. In the playoffs, he was instrumental in a major upset over the Seattle Supersonics, setting a record with 31 blocks in the five-game series. Despite this, the Nuggets were eliminated in the second round by the Utah Jazz. 
In the 1994-95 season, Matambo earned his second All-Star selection and his first NBA Defensive Player of the Year award. After his final season with the Nuggets in 1995-96, he entered free agency and signed a five-year, $55 million contract with the Atlanta Hawks in 1996. Matambo continued to excel with the Hawks, leading them to consecutive 50-plus win seasons and winning two more Defensive Player of the Year awards. In his last season with the Hawks, 1999-2000, he averaged 11.5 points and a league-high 14.1 rebounds per game. Mutombo was traded to the Philadelphia 76ers in February 2001, where he had a standout season, earning his fourth Defensive Player of the Year award and helping the team reach the NBA Finals. The Sixers won Game 1 against the Los Angeles Lakers but ultimately lost the series in five games. In 2002, Mutombo was traded to the New Jersey Nets, but an injury limited him to 24 games. He played as a sixth man in the Nets' finals run before the team bought out his contract. In 2003, Matambo signed a two-year deal with the New York Knicks. He was traded to the Chicago Bulls in 2004 and then to the Houston Rockets before the 2004-2005 season. With the Rockets, Matambo formed a productive center partnership with Yao Ming. During the 2007-2008 season, after Yao's injury, Matambo averaged double digits in rebounds and helped the Rockets achieve a 22-game winning streak, a team record at the time. In January 2008, he surpassed Kareem Abdul-Jabbar for the second-most career-blocked shots in NBA history. Matambo considered retirement but returned for his final professional season in 2009, becoming the oldest player in the league. He helped the Rockets reach the playoffs but suffered a knee injury in Game 2, which ended his season and career. Shortly after, Mutombo announced his retirement from professional basketball. About Daikimbi Mutombo's humanitarian work. Outside of basketball, Mutombo is well known for his humanitarian efforts. In 1997, he established the Daikimbi Mutombo Foundation to enhance the quality of life in the Democratic Republic of the Congo. In 2004, he joined the NBA's Basketball Without Borders program to improve infrastructure in Africa. Mutombo has also been a dedicated supporter of the Special Olympics, serving as a global ambassador and member of the International Board of Directors. One of his most significant humanitarian achievements is the Bayamba Marie Mutombo Hospital, which opened in 2007. This $29 million, 300-bed facility was the first modern medical center built in the Kinshasa area in nearly 40 years. Health and Death On October 15, 2022, Matambo announced that he was undergoing treatment for a brain tumor. He died from brain cancer surrounded by his family on September 30, 2024, at the age of 58. About Daikimbi Mutambo's net worth and house Daikimbi Mutambo's net worth is estimated to be around $75 million. He amassed this substantial wealth through a combination of his successful NBA career, various business ventures, and lucrative endorsement deals. Matambo is the proud owner of an expansive mansion in Atlanta, valued at $6.8 million. This luxurious property is situated on a two-acre lot and boasts over 13,000 square feet of living space. As we wrap up, we thank you for watching and encourage you to engage with our content by liking the video and sharing your thoughts in the comments section.